My family's been working in the forest industry since the 1880s. Scandinavians are kind of independently minded, and this is a perfect place for that type of attitude. The woods is a great work environment. There's no cubicles, no computers. Essentially, you're a boss in many respects. It's not the most glamorous work, but it's something we know and it's something we do well. It's really, it's, it's tough to put into words how, how working in the woods just gets in your blood. I don't know, like today's miserable. I, there's no other place I'd rather be. Being a Douglas fir, this is the primary species that Simon Vincent was after. It's good for lumber, it's primary building supply. Most of America is built with this. They'd use a crosscut saw to cut a bottom cut into the tree and with this heavier ax, they start removing the chips on that cut. If you're cutting a tree that's 12 feet in diameter, it takes a certain amount of effort. I think anywhere from two or three hours to an entire day. Sometimes they had to go back the next day and finish it. I'm going to be inserting a springboard, which is a traditional working platform that the timber followers worked on during Simon Benson's time. Nowadays, we put a flat cut in and then come up from the bottom, which gives the log a nice flat bo bottom on it, and it leaves the, you're wasting wood out of the stump instead of wasting wood out of the log. fungus came in, it spread like wildfire. They had this common ground that they were fighting for. When the gold rush began, it's like turning on the faucet. The United States is a nation of nations. 